Hello everyone, welcome to Home Cooking with me Hema Subramanian. Today's recipe is for all the chicken lovers. It's a very simple and easy to make chicken fry. This is called Asari chicken and this is very popular in many parts of Tamil Nadu. So why wait, let's get started and check it out. I have all the ingredients needed for the Asari chicken fry here. Now take a wide large kadai and add about 3 tablespoons of sesame oil. Once the oil is hot, add 1 teaspoon of mustard seeds. After the mustard seeds start splattering, Add about 10 red chilies roughly cut up. Now add about 400 grams of shallots roughly cut up to the kadai and mix well. Shallots add a really nice flavour but if you want you can replace them with regular onions. After you've sautéed the shallots for about 5 minutes, add half teaspoon of turmeric powder and 2 teaspoons of rock salt and mix well. Maintain the flame on a medium while you sauté. Now add the nicely washed and clean chicken pieces with bone. I have taken about 1 kilo of chicken pieces here. Make sure you cut them into small pieces for a nice taste. Now mix the chicken pieces with the shallots. You can also use country chicken for this recipe. It would taste great. Add fresh curry leaves at this point for a nice flavour. You can add as many as you want. Give it all a nice quick mix and cover the kadai with the lid. Cook the chicken for about 15 minutes on medium flame. As you can see, the chicken has released a lot of water after being cooked for 15 minutes. I haven't added a single drop of water. This is all the juices from the chicken. Now mix all this well and add 1 teaspoon of red chilli powder. Next, add about 2 teaspoons of coriander powder and mix well by keeping the flame on high. You should cook this until the water here totally evaporates. The moisture is almost gone and at this stage you can pinch a piece of chicken and check if the chicken is cooked or not. Keep mixing until the moisture is fully gone but make sure that you do not overcook the chicken because it can become very hard and rubbery. Now that all that excess moisture is evaporated, turn off the heat at this point. Transfer the asari chicken fry to a bowl and garnish it with some finely chopped coriander leaves. There you go, here is this amazing asari chicken stir fry that is easily made with the simple ingredients available to you. The flavours are incredible and you can enjoy this as is or with some nice hot steaming rice, rasam or sambar along with it. Wow, that tasted incredible and the flavours are all just spot on. It's such a simple dish that anyone can make, even bachelors can make it very easily because of all the minimal ingredients used in the recipe. So do give it a try and let me know how it turned out for you guys and do share it with your family and friends. So for more exciting and wonderful recipes, subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell icon to get your notifications. You can now buy the second edition of our home cooking book at shop.homecookingshow.in.